I think it is just for me, it's about being outside and connecting to nature, but also connecting to the weather. The weather is, has a huge influence on me. I love the summer, but rather than hibernate indoors in the winter, I tend to go out and in fact that's the time where I enjoy walking along the beach the most. That's where the weather and the sky and all of those things put together just I find, yeah, it's, I guess that's probably what's influencing the work the most. So my process is, I am a studio painter, um, so I don't um, set up an easel outside and uh, don't tend to paint outside. But what I do is I am constantly returning to these places. So these are places and um, both physical places and I guess places in my mind in terms of the, some of the water work that um, I, I return to over and over and I take for the landscapes I take um, lots of what I kind of call source material, source photos. I, I work with those to decide on a, a particular composition or more particularly a time of day. I call them transition moments where it's either dawn or dusk, particularly both for the landscape work and for the ocean work. There's a lot more interest for me in those, the light is fading or the light's um, becoming stronger. For me, oil is the, is, the, is the one. I love the mess, I love the smell. <laughs> It's just all part of the, the joy of painting for me is having oil paints all over me. <laughs> just this want, need, constant need to learn about what's actually behind these phenomena. What's uniting all of those things for me is really how to capture with oil paint what's happening in space and light, air and water.